Oh, Vicky. I brought you flowers, but I brought you something much, much better. If you were here right now, they'd say, Hey, Mommy. Oh, Mom. I did it. We did it. Found our, our baby girls. You're probably already up there somewhere. You want more? <sighs> if you could come back one more time, and I know it cost you. If it takes everything you got, you gotta come see this, Vic. You gotta come see Shell and Bridget. Come on, Vicky, see us. One more time, and I know it cost you. If it takes everything you got, you gotta come see this, Vic. You gotta come see Shell and Bridget. Come on, Vicky, see us. Fine, aren't they? Oh, no. First, when you came and in my dreams, then to both of us, you were leading us here the whole time, weren't you? I couldn't understand it all at first, you know. Why I couldn't cross over. Why I had to contact you. It's so clear to me now. This whole journey has been so hard for you. Understanding it all and then leaving it all. I have to ask you to do one more thing for me. Let yourself be happy. You know, when I was still in your world, holding on, I used to dream of you holding our babies. And I had faith that that would happen one day. And that faith kept me alive long enough so that I could give birth to them and name them. You made my dream come true. Michelle, Richard, they're with you now, Jake, and that's all that matters. But you're gone. You, they're gonna need you. They're gonna, they're 
They're gonna need you to, to sing to them. They're gonna need you to tell secrets. They're gonna need you to brush their hair and to hold them when they you know cry. What? I think, I think you can handle that, McKinnon. You and Mommy. But they're not gonna get to know what a beautiful person their mother is. I know that the thing I wanted to do most in life was give you children. And I've done that. A I want you to listen to me, okay? The way that you love me. Molly. And those children. It's a forever kind of love, you know? It doesn't die. And because of it, neither do we. Hey, come on now. I'm telling you, death can't touch us. Jake, Jake. Now that you see me here, as I am, and you found Molly, Molly and you found our babies, there's just No reason to be sad about what we have been. I want you to look in my eyes and believe. I want to believe, Vicky, but... Do you want to know what dying's like? Because I'm going to tell you now. Dying is like over in the blink of an eye. It's just like forgotten the minute you cross over. And now I just, ah, oh, I just feel this incredible peace. I don't know. I guess I can't really explain it, but I just feel like, I feel like everything's just the way it's supposed to be. How do you know that? I don't know. I just do. You know, all those questions that I had that were just haunt haunting me, I feel, forgive the pun, <laughs> they're just all answered now. And... Bridget, you, me, everything's just the way it's supposed to be. I, I, I can't stay very much longer. You have to try. <laughs> I don't have to try. I'm happy. I'm so happy. I'm happier than I've ever been in my life. Uh, where will you go? Moving on. I can do that now. Don't, okay. So many things I have to say and so many questions that I have to ask you, please, don't leave us. Have to. Keep talking. Because now that I know that I'm never going to see you again, I know. I don't know how I'm going to say goodbye. Me? to earn this faith that you have in me. Very special woman. You know, I saw you coming into Jake's life. He was lost, and you found him. You knew that? Mm -hmm. You were so ready to love Molly and to be loved. You know, maybe that's, that's why I came to you first, because you could let me in. In my dreams? No. In your heart. 
Because of that, we found my babies. And I will be forever grateful to you for that. Vicky, you say everything's as it should be, but I can't help but feeling like it's wrong. I mean, these, these precious babies, they came from you. They belong to you. They belong to us. Because we can both love them. And I, I, I just know that there can never be too much love. I am certain of that. He's gonna be a great mom, isn't she, Jake? You've... You've done that before. I haven't. I mean, I haven't been a mom to a baby. I, I don't want to blow it. I really don't want to let you down, Vicky. What are you talking about? You're a very good mom. I've seen you with Abigail, remember? Abigail? Abig I didn't raise Abigail. But you love her. You love her. You have such a big, wonderful heart. And it's not going to let you go wrong. And, there, and there's no way that you could let me down. There's just no way. It's because of you that I feel incredibly blessed. I mean, you found your way into Jake's life, and, and you found your way into... into my baby's lives. You're the one, Molly. I knew it. I can't help but feeling sad, Vicky. I mean, these kids, they're yours, and I feel like I'm taking them from you. Taking anything from me. You are giving me the most extraordinary, beautiful gift. Because I know that my babies are exactly where they're supposed to be. Jake. I can't stay here much longer. It's, it's time. So this is it, I say goodbye. How can I accept that because I can face Anything but saying goodbye. Well, you're not going to get rid of me that easy. <laughs> Every time you look in their eyes, you're going to see a part of me looking back. I can't. Jake, I can't stay any longer. But you have to know that everything's going to be all right. How can everything here be all right if you're gone? I mean, I just hate to think the thought of you, of you being alone. I'm not going to be alone. I'm not. I'm going to find Bridget. I'm going to find my dad. I don't think there is alone where I'm going. So one day... One day... I'm going to see you again. This is not the last. I'm sorry. This is not the last time. Do you know how they say that people's souls are connected forever? Yes. Well, I think that's right. I think that's. I think that's how it is with us. <laughs> you know, uh, when I wrote Rely on Jake on my sneakers, well, you can rely on love. Is this big? It's very. Very big. Honey. It doesn't matter if you see me or not. Because I'm always going to be a part of you.
Will you pardon me? Always. 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 Always.